There were scenes of jubilation on Saturday night as Christopher Miller and Shaquille Haynes were named the winners of this year's Forever I Do Dream Wedding competition. The annual event is hosted by the Nation Publishing Company. The couple won the hearts of Barbadians and the judges before a packed audience at Hilton Barbados. Nation News caught up with Christopher and Shaquille on Sunday at New Dimensions Ministries. Although their victory was still sinking in, the couple had some advice for other young people. We can definitely say that love is a very serious commitment. Um, we're in the process now of walking out our premarital counseling stages. Yeah. Up to last week, Friday, I think that was, we have a session. And we were talking to our counselor about the, the weightiness that comes when you make a decision to, you know, join yourself to a partner and walk through um, life and marriage. So love in itself is a choice. So as it relates to, you know, advice that mm -hmm. we would give to young people, mm -hmm. find God first. Yeah. You know, because at the end of the day, if you want to have a successful marriage, mm -hmm. then God is the center. And he's the only body that can keep, you know, you and your partner together. Communicate at all times. Talk about everything. Talk about nothing at all. Mm -hmm. Just find a way to communicate um, at all times. Talk about every single thing. That's one of the things that has kept us yeah. um, so far because we make it a priority to talk about everything. And to jump um, on that, um, yeah. I think accountability and mentorship is very important, um, especially in the the generation we live in because persons may tend to keep a lot of things to themselves um, but connect yourself with people who have walked through it before so you don't make the same mistakes that people would have made whether they were transitioning into marriage or in marriage so I would say be accountable and find good mentors and surround yourself with those people and it's critical because we don't know everything you know and it's easy in the society that we live in to have that microwave approach it's like you know you press a button and bam it's a yeah. result but relationships take time they take effort they take commitment and if that is not something that you're not ready to, to commit yourself to, no. then take time to figure out yourself before you go and, you know, get with somebody else. Because now that person is coming mm -hmm. with their own stuff, so you don't know what you want, you don't have stuff figured out, and then they come and it's a whole catastrophe. So yeah. take time, figure out, discover yourself, again, find God, um, and stay accountable at all times. It'll work. Love will find you.